Good morning, my dear students. Today we are going to continue with the same lesson of geography, globe, latitudes, and longitudes. As you know, lines of latitude and lines of longitude are used to locate places around the world. Additionally, the lines of longitude are also used to calculate time. For today is calculating the time along the longitudes. Before we begin, let us establish some basic facts about lines of longitude. Now, what are longitudes? The line, the imaginary lines drawn vertically connecting the North Pole and the South Pole are called lines of longitude or meridians of longitude. All lines of longitude are semicircles. Next one is the prime meridian. What is prime meridian? The prime meridian that is zero degree which passes through Greenwich in London. Lines of longitude are measured from the center of the earth. The prime meridian that divides the earth into the eastern hemisphere and the western hemisphere. There are totally 360 lines of longitude and these lines merged at the poles. It equally divides into 180 degree west and 180 degree east. 0 degree to 180 degree west is called the western longitudes and 0 degree to 180 degree east is called the eastern longitudes. Important facts you need to know is the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. Therefore, the places to the east of the Greenwich see the sun first and are therefore further farther ahead in time while the places in the west see the sun later and are therefore behind in time fact number two is every 15 degree of longitude represents one hour fact number three one degree of longitude is four minutes of the prime meridian of greenwich meridian is always at zero degree sun does not shine on all the parts of the earth at the same time in 1884 children scientists divided the world into 24 time zones greenwich in Greenwich, England was chosen to be the location for universe time because it is located along the prime meridian. Then let us see what is standard meridian. There are 24 time zones in the world. The earth takes one day to rotate on its axis. So in one hour the earth rotates 15 degree. So for one day 24 hours one rotation it takes 360 longitudes. In 24 hours earth rotates 360 longitudes and for one hour earth rotates 15 degree of longitudes. So for one degree it takes 4 minutes. This is the world time zone map. Time zones. Let us study about the time zones. The local time of a place is fixed on the moment of the sun. When the sun shines exactly overhead, it is midday or 12 noon at time at that place. Midday occurs at different times at different meridians. The time in each zone is calculated by this universal time also known as Greenwich Mean Time that is GMT. Then the last point which we are going to study is the Indian Standard Time IST. India lies between 68 degree east 
longitude and 97 degree east longitude in india longitudinal line extends from 68 degree east to 98 degree east several longitudes line passes through india so indian standard time not logical not logical hence 82.5 degree east line of longitude prime meridian is taken as the standard time for whole country and that is why children 82.5 degree we have as the standard meridian now the local time when we talk about the local time if the time is 12 noon at greenwich meridian it is 12 4 pm at 1 degree east line of longitude and 11 56 am at 1 degree west line of longitude what is am and pm am means anti meridian before noon and pm means post meridian after noon the world has 24 time zones some countries have great longitudinal extent and that countries have more than one standard time m r france has 12 time zones russia and usa has 11 time zones australia antarctica and uk have 9 time zones canada have 6 time zones denmark new zealand have 5 time zones so children this is about the longitude and the time so read the chapter thoroughly and try to understand the concept thank you